The program, it belongs to the Institutes of Textile and Clothing of the Hong Kong Polytechnic University. Uh, the, our department is one of the oldest department in PolyU. So long before we become university, our department already there to train textile expertise, textile scientists, because at that time, Hong Kong is still a very, very um, strong production base of the textile industry. Although the, um, this, the whole industry has shifted uh, from production to other aspects in supply chain, for example, product development, fashion design, fashion retail and marketing. So our programs are uh, in here is also covering all these aspects so that when you study in the ITC, BA and fashion textiles, no matter which specialisms you are in, you will have a chance to learn something from all the aspects in the fashion supply chain. So that makes you very competitive uh, for the fashion industry. At the same time, when other industries, they, they are looking for textile or uh, technology or uh, design experts, you are also capable to take up those challenge. We have 92 quota in the coming years, and we have 170 senior years place uh, quota. Uh, those are uh, specifically for applicants who have completed their um, associate degree um, or high diploma degree in other institutions. And among all these, we also very welcome any international school students. If you are having IB or other GCE A level public exams, we also very welcome you to apply for our programs. And uh, we, we set aside every year uh, particular numbers of quota uh, for the IB and the uh, GSE A level students to apply for. And we will go through interview uh, in order to um, to choose the best students uh, for our program. So for um, for the DSC students, you are entering a program with the four years uh, uh, arrangement. For the um, senior year play students, you are coming in in the third year, and the number of credits is less than the uh, um, the four year student. But uh, it is not half because they will definitely have some subjects or credits that you have to bridge in in order to make sure you have the full understanding of the whole fashion industry. We have five disciplines, technology, design, deepwear design and technologies, retail and marketing, intermediate apparel and active wear. So let me start with the retail and marketing. As I am a fashion business professor, I'm very familiar with this and I believe um, many students or applicants today are passionate in fashions, but you may not actually want to be a designer. So fashion business will be very, very uh, suitable for you. And um, for example, um, we have subjects like fashion retail buying, fashion visual merchandising. Now we, we are teaching that with the virtual reality. That means you will do it with the virtual reality uh, technologies on the visual merchandising. That's very exciting. We have fashion brand management, which is very important for basically all, all brands, not just fashion brand. We have only channel marketing and retailing. Uh, I've been teaching that subject, teaching students how to design online and offline interactions, mobile apps, big data analytics, and social media um, engagement. And we have luxury fashion management, uh, which is a very unique features um, over the other business program in Hong Kong. So if you may not know, Hong Kong is the number five luxury market in the world. So luxury fashion management is so important in Hong Kong and no other business school offering these subjects. Um, so that is something we have an edge. We have fashion advertising and promotion fashion entrepreneurship management, and fashion communication studies. So the fashion communication study are new subjects that teaching you how to be, um, how to communicate through the social media uh, properly and how to communicate with, um, with your target customers. 
Another disciplines that I would like to highlight is the, our intimate apparel and active wear. So intimate apparels include the underwear um, and the lingeries, which focus on the comfort protection, fashionable and uh, alluring uh, features. Well, the spot wear, um, it will be the active wear will be the um, swimsuit, yoga clothes. Nowadays, it's so are so important. Basically, all brands all luxury brands, fashion brands, they will have a collection for that. So intimate apparel and activewear is the sole provider in Asia. So you cannot find another programs in Hong Kong if you are interested on these development. And uh, I, I can tell you that this is a very good discipline. First, that is the sole provider. And you can see that all brands are going for, for these directions and clothes that not just spot wear clothes the normal daily wear casual wear clothes they now focus on the functions so these are important knowledge that you should uh, you can obtain from the intimate apparel and active wear for the fashion design that's our long-term most popular discipline uh, that uh, we are we are very proud of we nurture nature a lot of top talent designers and they are having their own labels and they are working globally and um, and 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 doing very well after they graduate. So I, I would like to emphasize that when you go for the fashion design discipline, you need to have passion and uh, you need to have very strong originality and you're willing to work very hard as design takes you a lot more time uh, because you're never satisfied. And we have some new subjects like menswear design, occasional wear design, and fit solutions, so that when you are graduate from the design discipline, you are not only ready to start your own labels, but you are ready to start a lot of different aspects of collections. Other than uh, design discipline, we have a very closely related um, discipline called knitwear design and technologies. Knitwear design also also emphasize the same um, design elements that we talked about. You need to be very creative. You need to uh, work very hard. But for the knitwear design, uh, it's slightly different because the technologies they used is mainly on the knitting machines. So the knitting machine, I can say only probably you have it uh, for this. Uh, discipline because the machines are so expensive and it's not easy to operate but our students have a chance to learn it from scratch uh, and uh, you are able to kind of like a 3d print out your collections through the uh, knitting machines um, that's so exciting and they're so uh, um, uh, uh, unique uh, in Hong Kong now you can see that even shoes sneakers we use the knitting technologies like the fly knit in Nike and other uh, knitting um, uh, uh, technologies in by Adidas and other brands. So knitting technologies uh, is a, has a very bright future. If you um, if you have the uh, the knowledge and uh, the, uh, the ability to design uh, products like that, and uh, you they also have few trips. Um, that's a that's a very good alternative or another choice if you are interested in design. Finally, I would like to uh, talk about the technology specialism. They are also the sole education provider in Hong Kong because uh, no other university have these facilities that we have. And this is the longest tradition part of a poly U. And, um, and there are some new subjects I would like to highlight. For example, the function focused uh, fibrous products and technologies uh, because from the fiber levels, we already did and uh, uh, have certain uh, features and very function, uh, special functions to make people uh, feel comfortable. And we also have the sustainability in fashion and textiles. This subject is so unique because it is not just talking about the um, the common footprints of the of the garments. It's also talk about branding and marketing. This is a subject that integrate business and technologies. And I teach that subject as well with our colleagues 
uh, with the expertise in the um, the life cycle assessment of uh, fashion products. And we have a 3D CAD pattern. Uh, this one uh, is the trend of future because when you do the 3D CAD, it, you can see from here, the 3D CAD and virtual sampling is the, is the future trend. I know fashion brand, they're changing the whole uh, design process into digital in the last two years. They hire over 100 people who knows these 3D CAD software. So our students, once they graduated, uh, they already are equip equipped with this um, uh, ability to develop uh, fashion products digitally in the computers. And then uh, they send the patents to the factories and the factory will do all the production. And technology specialism also have other exciting subjects like functional apparel, smart textiles and wearable applications. So as I mentioned to you, the sensors uh, embedded in the, in, the, in, the, in the fabrics is the trend of future. You always want to know your health that's become the necessity of our society in future. So um, we have these subjects to equip you to take up these challenges and opportunities. 